What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. My name is Morgan Johnson. Thank you so much for coming and checking out my channel. I greatly appreciate it. We have an interesting one today. We're going to be trying TikTok viral food snack hacks. Some of them look pretty intriguing. Others look pretty petrifying. So I'm, I'm having mixed feelings here today, alright? But without further ado, let's jump into it. Alright, first up, we have three things that I never thought I would say in the same sentence. We have cinnamon. We have watermelon and we have mustard. Now, I will say this is a two part TikTok uh, because one is the watermelon and the mustard together. The other is the cinnamon and the watermelon together. I mean, I'm gonna state the obvious here that I think these two are gonna be a better combination, the cinnamon and the watermelon. Uh, but people have been going crazy over this mustard watermelon trend. So we're gonna roll the clip and try this out. Right, we're gonna do the watermelon and cinnamon one first. So here we go, we have the cinnamon, let's try it. Okay, that is delicious. For the first one, I wanna go ahead and start with the cinnamon, just because I think it's gonna taste better and I don't wanna like completely ruin my taste buds uh, with the mustard one, so we're gonna drizzle on some cinnamon. All right, truthfully, uh, I don't know if you're old enough or if you even did this, but I am petrified of cinnamon after the cinnamon challenge a very long time ago. So I'm not super looking forward to this because I almost choked to death the last time, but here we go, watermelon and cinnamon. Oh, that's good. That's insanely good. Mmm. All right, so the, the watermelon's already sweet, obviously, but the cinnamon just gives it like a warm feeling in your mouth. That is stupid good. I don't know why I haven't been eating it like this. I always eat my watermelon with salt. I might honestly just switch to cinnamon because that is banging. And now we're gonna try the mustard. I'm only gonna do a little bit. Mustard. <laughs> Next up, we have the mustard and the watermelon. And I'm quite petrified. Oh, I'm spilling it. Oh, this is a joke. The, TikTok, I think, is playing us. And I think they're just trying to see how far people will actually go. But here we have it. Yellow mustard and watermelon. worst combination I've ever put in my mouth. I would just tell you straight up, the internet is hardcore lying to you. TikTok is saying how far you will take eating weird food combinations because this is, oh, oh God, it's coming back. All right, uh-uh, zero out of 10. Next up, we have pickles, Doritos, and cream cheese. Just roll the clip. Why does this kind of look good? I've been seeing this weird food combination all over my For You page. Doritos with cream cheese topped with a pickle. I had a pickle on top of a Reese's peanut butter cup. This shouldn't be that bad. Got my chip. I'm using whipped cream cheese because it's just easier to spread. Add your pickle. Oh, add your pickle on top. We're gonna give it a try. Mmm, banging. Oh. I have my Dorito with cream cheese, a pickle on top, and supposedly it's delicious, so. Let's see. Hmm. I wouldn't say it's bad per se, but I also don't want to say like it's good. I would say it's bearable. Like if somebody handed me a plate of these and I needed to be polite and eat them, I for sure would, but I wouldn't make it on my own again. I'll rate it like a four out of 10. Next up, we have a chocolate bar and some cheese. I don't know how these two are gonna go together, but let's watch the clip. Cheese and chocolate, does it bang? Let's find out. <laughs> how does that taste nice? Like how? I have my cheese, I have my chocolate, we're gonna put them together and we're 
We're gonna eat it. Oh. Oh my god. That was worse than the watermelon and the mustard. I, I understand where they were going. Like a salty, sweet, creamy maybe. Oh, that was one of the worst things I've ever put in my mouth. No doubt about it. I'm gonna rate that one a zero out of 10. Today I'm trying more of the weird food combos that celebrities like to eat. Today I wanted to try Kourtney Kardashian's famous avocado pudding. As seen on Keeping Up With The Kardashians and eaten by Addison Rae. All you need is one avocado, one tablespoon of cane sugar, half a cup of almond milk, and then one tablespoon of light manuka honey, but I don't know what the manuka is. Blend until smooth. Here is the finished result. Give it a try. This is fucking fire. It tastes like sweet avocado, but it tastes like a really good dessert. This one has multiple steps to it, but first and foremost, we need an avocado, which I have. I tried to get a pretty like soft one already so that the blender doesn't have to do too much work. Um, and I think I got a pretty good one. So I'm going to bust that bad boy open, a perfect avocado. I'm gonna get the pit out. Next up, avocado has to go into a blender. I would normally use a spoon to do this, but all I have is a butter knife right now because my dishes are dirty. But essentially you just go all around the sides. And then, yep, it's so much easier with a spoon. Avocado is in. Now we need one tablespoon of cane sugar, which I already have in my jar. Put that in. Next we need half a cup of almond milk. Next is one tablespoon of Manuka honey. I have not a single clue what Manuka even stands for. So I got the store brand honey and that's what we're gonna go with. All right. Last step is to blend it. So I'm gonna do that and then we'll see how it turns out. It is done. It looks intriguing to say the least. Um. But we're gonna, we're gonna give it a shot. Hold on. Dude, it's good. Oh man. Whoever, I'm, gonna, I'm not even gonna credit the Kardashians because they be having personal chefs and stuff. Whoever invented this, I mean, you're on to something. That, this consistency is so smooth and silky in your mouth. That is ridiculously good. This one gets a solid, I'm gonna even give it a nine out of 10. This is really, really good. And just like that guys, this is the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you wanna try anything else, feel free to comment down below. I am down to try anything at least twice. Not the watermelon and the mustard one though. I am never trying that again. Save yourself, don't do it. But I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.